Hello guys, today I want to show you a new improvement, new small feature in the latest Laravel 10.9. Inform request Dries Vince suggested and approved by James Brook and Taylor that in form request you don't have to specify rules. Pretty weird case scenario, right, don't you think? But sometimes you can create form requests just for the authorize method. So you don't have the validation with rules for the fields, but you want just to authorize the request, usually in APIs, I would say. And then you want to return 403 forbidden or make the request pass. So for that specific case, let me demonstrate. In one of my recent courses about Booking.com API, which is not updated to Laravel 10.9, I have this post request to post a booking from a user. And if the validation is fired, there's 422 result, status code, and the apartment is not available for those dates. So in the code, we have this rules array, which checks the apartment ID for the dates and guests. And there's also authorize to manage whether that person is authorized to make a booking with gates. So that is a typical scenario. And if we remove the rules here in the earlier Laravel version 10 point something, it's not 10.9 and we send, so we will have an error, store booking request rules does not exist. So before 10.9, Laravel would throw an error if you don't define the rules and if you just want to authorize. In Laravel 10.9, it works like this. So I've quickly created a project, it's not an API, so this is a pretty bad example, but let's imagine. You have store user request for the registration. So in registered user controller, I've created a quick registration form with our package Lara starters, by the way, I will link that in the description below. So how to have that design on top of Laravel breeze. So anyway, let's imagine we have form request and we want to validate some rules, but maybe we don't want to validate some rules. Instead, we want to allow the registration to happen from, for example, IP address like request. Again, it's a pretty dumb example, but something like that return IP is something, something, whatever. So only those people would be authorized to register. And if we try to register with fake filler Chrome extension, we register. And since we're not on that IP address, we would get 403. But now, as you can see, Laravel does not throw an error of 500 that rules don't exist. So form request can just contain the authorized method and it would be a valid form request class. What I also want to point out is how the features are released in Laravel in general. So if you take a look at files changed, there's always a test. So first the change, the method exists check, and then the test. Test that request can pass without rules method. It's readable English language sentence and also a separate class that would demonstrate that ability. So that class is a perfectly valid form request class. That's all I wanted to show you today. So this is a new feature in 10.9. If you want more news, of course, subscribe to this channel because I will keep shooting videos about new features when they get released in Laravel. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.